Mike Tendo 64 presents. This is a man consumed by vengeance. And this is the man responsible for his exile. The name's Fox, Fox McCloud. My father passed away five years ago. To carry on his legacy, I brought his team out of retirement. Star Fox, the elite squadron he founded and died to protect. I've recruited the best teammates a squad leader could ask for. Like a brilliant young inventor and close friend from my academy days, Slippy Toad. And Falco Lombardi, a hotshot flyboy who's kind of a handful, but also one of the best pilots I've ever met. Ah, dang it! Ah! Yep, like I said, the best teammates a squad leader could ask for. Having a tough time there? Huh? <laughs> hey, what are you? <sighs> Hold still. It's ah, just cut the it out. Get your hands it. off of me. Oh, come on, just try it. I'm bored. It has been ten whole days since we left Soria, you know. I'm getting huh. so sick of the canned food. Huh? So guys, what should we eat first when mm -hmm. we get to Corneria? Well, where do you want to go? I was thinking here. Hey! Ugh. This is not a vacation! And that's Peppy Hare. My father's old wingman. A seasoned pro. The glue that holds the team together. And just look at this mess. Were you boys raised in a barn? Uh... And a bit of a nag. <laughs> All right! And no yelling! And which one of you boys messed with my desk? Oh, let's go to this restaurant at the new water park and eat some crab. You three ah! deaf! Hmm. Ah. Hey, what's that? It's a good luck charm, made out of General Pepper's fur, as a symbol of our friendship. Out of his fur? Nothing weird there. What? Ah! Ah! Seriously, you guys. The Cornerian army and Andros' forces have been at war for years now, and here you are, always joking around. 
Because there's nothing to worry about. Corneria's defenses are totally impenetrable. There's no way Andros could think he stands a chance of actually breaking through them. Huh? Rob, report. Distress signal received. Communications open. Star Fox, come in. Do you read me? General Pepper, what's going on? Corneria City is under attack from Andros's army. <gasps> what is that thing? No, it can't be. <laughs> that the crab you wanted? Does this mean he actually dared to rebuild it? General, what's your status? Please respond! I don't get it. I mean, seriously, why aren't they attacking the tower? They caught the Cornarian army completely by surprise. Why not blow it to pieces while they still have the advantage? Good point. These invaders... What they want... ...is me. What do you mean? The Great Fox has entered Corneria's orbit. Star Fox, move out! Man, I was really looking forward to this trip, too! Jeez, how'd these creeps even get through the city's defenses? Teleportation! Huh? They used a teleportation device! How could Andros even have a thing like that? We can worry about that later. Right now, we've just got to get those things away from the General. Well, the way those robots are homing in on him suggests they're equipped with advanced bio-tracking tech. So? What's your point? Well, if we have some way to erase his life signs, then... We want to save him, not off him, you crazy tadpole. Hey! Wait! Hold up! Oh. All hands evacuate! Get everyone out of the tower! The General, what about you, sir? Get out now! That's an order! Hurry! Does Peppy have to go to the bathroom right before every mission? <sighs> oh, sorry about that, guys! Took you long enough. Huh? <sighs> Let's go! That old gag again? Hey guys! Put on your new visors, okay? <laughs> it's game time, huh? All right, boys. Let's rock and roll! Check your G-Diffuser system. I'm fine. I'm okay. All systems go. I'm taking you all down. Ha! Huh. This new visor's not too shabby. Rob, how's the evac going? Relocation of civilians complete. The tower's being overwhelmed. Looks like someone kicked over an ant's nest. Switching to all range mode. You're mine. Incoming from behind. Use your brakes! Hey, Fox! It's ready to go! Copy that. Let's go! Did we get them all? Not yet! General Pepper, I need you to take cover in a sealed room right away. A sealed room? There's no time to explain. Please hurry! Cleaning in progress. Cleaning in progress. Uh, <laughs> Compartment sealed. Deodorizing in progress. Now it's my turn! What the? They're 
We're moving into the blast? It's my latest invention! Slip used fur from my lucky charm to make missiles that mimic Pepper's laugh signs! Pretty cool for something I just slapped together, right? Fox, now's our chance! All right, all units bomb volley now! Squash you like the insects you are. So, that's the boss man, huh? Slippy, Peppy, hang back and recover. Falco, you're with me. We've got to take down that ship. Do a barrel roll! Think that did it? Hey, Froggy! Don't call me Froggy! Come on, Slip! Where's that shield analysis? Got it! If we take out all those big laser cannons, we can dismantle that thing's G-diffuser system! Falco! Heading down below. We're not going to fall that easily! If you want to catch me, you have to try harder than that! What good a guided missile if it comes right back? Curse you, Star Fox! When Andros hears about this, you're through! You hear me? You're safe, General. Star Fox, we are once more in your debt. So you're sure you're all right? Hmm. Thanks to you. I hate to ask more of you so soon, but I need you to fly out to Sector Alpha. Expecting more trouble out there? We've received an urgent call for reinforcements, and we could use you on the front lines. Understood. We're on it. Oh, what about my crab? Guess there's no rest for the best. We're counting on you. All units, report. I'm fine. All peachy for me. This transmission is only for you. You know what this attack means. That Andros has dared to rebuild that device. Yes. I know I can trust you to do what must be done. And keep this quiet. Your teammates must not learn the truth. I understand. So, Fox McLeod, eh?
Hello guys and girls, I am Mike Scorpio of Mike Tendo 64 and I just wanted to thank you personally for watching this video. Uh, I didn't create it myself, I just put the two together, so there's no really any creative thoughts uh, put into it whatsoever. Just take one video, another video, put them together, they have a baby, it's this video. Um, so, credit where it's due, the first part is the 80s theme opening sequence, uh, Star Fox parody, which was created by new YouTubers, uh, Chani and Kimberly. So please be sure to check out their channel on YouTube as I'm pretty sure they will have a lot more great videos for our enjoyment in the near future. The second part, uh, or the main segment, is the official um, uh, The Battle Begins uh, anime, which was a like, sort, sort, sort of short intro uh, to Star Fox Zero, which premiered on April 20th and was created in collaboration with Shigeru Miyamoto, Production IG, and Wit Studios, uh, which actually made me even more hyped uh, to be able to play Star Fox Zero. I mean, I was never really a Star Fox fan to begin with. Uh, you know, I played it in Smash, I played it a couple of times, like Lila Wars, um, but never really, really taken in by the franchise per se. But after watching the anime, I am really all for it, and I can't wait for my first edition uh, print or Star Fox Zero to be in my hands, uh, which I will do an unboxing at a later date as well. So thank you very much guys again for watching and if you want to stay in touch with our news, reviews and personal views then go to our website MikeTendo64.com uh, You can also like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter and we're even on Tumblr as well. Uh, so guys, until next time, keep on gaming!